These are Lakey's Carbon Light Trekking Poles. Premium performance poles, carbon construction throughout, and some other excellent features that make these ideal for all types of backcountry usage. The poles are equipped with Lakey's Ergon Thermo Mid Grips. It's got really nice texturing here on these poles. Uh, ergonomics in play that make for very comfortable grip. You can see that there's also an extended portion of that texturing below the standard grip. This comes in handy, especially in winter months where you've got gloves and it's hard to make micro adjustments and then you run into places where you might want to be making constant adjustments to the poles. You're going across one switchback, you're coming back across the other and finding that in one instance you want one pole longer, you want the other shorter. So you're having to make these constant and frequent adjustments. With, with grips of this nature, you actually can just kind of change where you're grabbing and holding the poles for periods of time. So it cuts down on the number of times that you need to actually adjust the height of the poles. Again, in winter, gloved hands, it's also just a place that's easier to grab at the poles rather than the fairly narrow pole diameter. Also see that there are integrated wrist straps uh, that helps take wear and tear off of your wrists during extended usage. I've flipped up the top of the grip there. That actually allows me to adjust where that wrist strap is set to maximize the comfort for differing uses. On top of the poles, there's dimpling, there's different texturing there on an ovoid style top that fits nicely in the palm of your hands in those instances where that's where you'd prefer to have your hand rather than on the grip itself. The poles consist of three telescoping sections. Uh, the combination of carbon construction throughout and weight saving internal locking mechanisms allow these poles to check in at just 14.8 ounces, a weight that's certain to appeal even to ounce counting backpackers. That internal locking mechanism, I'll take a quick look at that, Again, keeps weight to a minimum. Uh, real simple design in that as you turn the pole, that mechanism travels up the threaded post. It broadens, and in broadening, it tightens against the interior of that pole section above it. Keeps weight to a minimum, as we mentioned, but also gives a nice, secure lock. At the bottom of the poles, you'll find Lakey's carbide flex tips. Carbide is actually just that lowest section where the tips come into contact with the ground. That's what provides traction on trails, on unimproved surfaces. If you are intending to use the poles at any point in time on improved surfaces, paved surfaces, um, you may want to check out uh, Lakey's rubber walking tips. They're sold separately, just a press fit design that goes right over the end of the carbide flex tip. This tip is designed in such a fashion that should you run into a situation where the poles are wedged between rocks or in a crack, you're in a spot where you have the potential to actually break the pole shaft sections. Instead, this will shear away and it's a replaceable part. So that's much preferable to actual broken shaft sections. You'll also see Lakey's low profile trekking basket. That is included. That design allows the poles to stay up above softer surfaces. So rather than the poles sinking too deeply into the ground and not giving you the purchase you need, these stop that. It's low profile, so if you are intending to use the poles in winter, in snow certainly, check out Lakey's snow baskets, deep powder baskets. They're sold separately, but they are interchangeable. It's broader diameter ba baskets that will ensure that the carbon light poles actually stay up on top of the surface.